What's up, y'all? This is Michael K. Malloy coming to you from SharePoint in 60 seconds. Now, a lot of us have gotten the uh, the update from Office 365 SharePoint Online with the modern look and feel. There's the modern uh, team site. There's the modern document library and the modern list. And um, all of it looks like it really stems from what happened uh, about a year and a half ago with the OneDrive for Business uh, when it got a new look and feel. Everything else now looks very similar to that. So what I did was I just created a, a new site which uh, looks pretty much the same but watch what happens when I go and select add a page by using the uh, the gear icon. And I have to admit this caught me by surprise today at work on my work tenant and I was a little bit embarrassing you know that it just all of a sudden popped to this new look and feel they said it was coming but they don't really tell you you know what day your server is gonna get updated nevertheless here it is so this is what a new uh, page looks like and it's like what do I do here well it's asking you to name it so we'll just call it uh, site page demo one and you got you hit enter it accepts that as the name uh, and then it takes you to another little section here where you can you can go with text if you want um, or if you want to get rid of this little section you can just hit the trash icon say yes and you can hit the plus button to add a new element underneath uh, the title and when you hit the plus you're you know given these particular options now these are site pages um, from everything I can understand so now we have we have the old web part pages way back from 2007 we've got wiki pages and we have these new site pages so this is actually a site page and it's held in all you it's held inside the site pages document library and it's accessed through this link here uh or hyperlink rather if you hover over it you'll see it, it says site pages so this is the normal site pages library uh it's modernized i'll, I'll show you it in a moment nevertheless this is a site page and uh, I think it's geared towards being more friendly for mobile touch screens etc you can add images you can add a, an actual document video um, you can embed some script here if you need to the highlighted content will show uh, you can filter it to show um, certain files or certain content that that you want to uh, surface to your user news headlines quick links yammer site activity so one thing that that was surprising for me is that I was expecting a new wiki page when I clicked on you know add a page but it defaults to the team site or the to the uh, site pages rather and you'll notice that there is no way to really add a web part here um, I read something that mentioned you can add some custom web parts but as far as being able to pull in you know a view from a list or document library I don't see that here and it, from what I understand at the current time the only way to, to, to do that to show the lists and libraries on a on a page would be using a wiki page or a web part page which I'll show you how you can still access that in a moment uh, so I'm just gonna leave this alone and basically just go ahead and save this save and close and you'll notice that when you go back out to pages you'll see that it's checked out to me and it's not published so that means that should mean that no one uh, no end user should be able to see this so here I went to my site pages library and there's the home page where I just came from good old how to use this library that no one ever uses and here's the page I just created so if I go in go back in and if I want to have end users actually see what I created then I can click on publish and there we go it's published 
So let's say you're, you're freaking out and you're wondering, well, what happened to my ability to be able to create uh, new wiki pages? Well, I thought I could just click on this plus new and I would have an option for wiki, web part, etc. But lo and behold, if you click on this plus new, it's going to generate a new site page with this modern this modern site page. So let me go ahead and save and close this bad boy. And we're going to bounce into our site pages library. So this even though it says pages, it's not the pages library. It is the site pages library. And here you should get an option, there we go, of adding a new, if you click the arrow, you'll get a fly out for wiki page, web part page. Site page is what we just created. So if we go to wiki page, you'll notice the good old familiar wiki. So you can do your thing there. So I just wanted to give you a, a quick little insight uh, just in case you get freaked out when you go to add a new page and you get that new site page look and feel uh, and you but you're really looking for a wiki there's how you get back to your wiki so hope this has been helpful hope you have a great day great evening no uh, thanksgiving right around the corner um, you know show thanks be thankful uh, life is great no matter how bad it seems and uh, hope you all have a great great thanksgiving